Hello everybody, it's me, it's Farm. We're here with a bit more Deep Rock Galactic Survivor and today we are going to be doing another four science run. So, a few artifacts have been turned off for this one. We've only actually got three, uh, five active, sorry. We've got the scanners, the DRG coupons, the thing that gives you reload speed per um, unique tag and the ammo rig for extra fire rate. And we're going to see just how many projectiles we can fire in a run. I'm cheating. The build should be able to fire a lot, I think. We should be getting close to a million. I'd like to think we get close to a million. So this is how we're going to set up the build anyway. Well, in fact, if the numbers are to be believed, we should be getting far in excess of a million. But I don't think something's working. And we'll see that at the end because I've already played the run. But anyway, this is how we set up the run. We will go in to the salt pits. We're going hazard five. We're going to be going on the gunner, my least played class. And we're going to be going with the weapon specialist. Again, one of my uh, least played classes. I... I no, not a fan, but that, that's how we're going in. So uh, let's get over to this run. He does have access to some very good projectile weapons with some very good fire rate, and we're going to be picking the best of those. But let's not forget, fire rate doesn't equal necessarily damage, especially when you don't have piercing. This one gets a little sweaty. Hope you enjoy it. Let's start this run then. So what have we got to do first mission? I think it's going to be Morkite or something horrible. What's well, got a feeling? Oh, no, it's flowers for Mrs. Dwarf. Oh, and all the gold's there. Perfect. Right, we'll be well set up for our level 5 re-roll then. We will. Um, where we'll probably undoubtedly have to re-roll for the LMG turrets, which is what we want first. Uh, I will take the lead bursters if they if they crop up. Um, yeah, we'll take the reload speed on the minigun. It's very slow, so that will help. There's a hidden flower over there in that little cove. We'll go and get that. It's a very special flower, that one. Very important. Must be retrieved. That was level 4. Oh, some luck. Early luck, definitely nice. Oh my god, there was a there was a trap. We somehow dodged the trap. And now we're leaving. Nitra. This will be our level five. We've got six re-rolls in the bank. Oh, it wasn't quite our level five. It was. Don't want those. Don't want those. We don't want those. Yeah. We'll take the LMG gun platform first. All right, we've still got some more gold we can get on this, which we need to snaffle up before 18. Uh, sorry, 18, before 15. But first off, we're going to go and get some sort of scanner, I would hope. Scanner or the fire rate thing. I will take the fire rate thing immediately. Because it will just increase our fire rate. We want as many projectiles as we can, so the earlier we get that, the better, really. We do want it before we get all our scanners. We don't just want to get nine scanners. Right, we'll take it straight away. So that's it. We're always doing 50% more fire rate right off the bat. Now we just need mining turrets. Preferably plasma as well, but I will take just mining. And we've got flowers to get. Another flower. Rolly Boy is causing some problems with the with the move speed. But nothing we can't handle. We'll get some more move speed at some point. So we've got the ammo rig and we've got the... We've got a couple of artifacts enabled. Mostly scanners. Scanners and things to increase reload speed and fire rate. But only the, the best of the best for those. Only a couple of artifacts. I want mostly scanners. I want to abuse the shop. The ammo rig was a, was a very early pick for... For reasons relating to, I think that will increase the projectile count the most. The earlier we get that. As well as being generally useful in keeping us alive. There's one more nitro patch after this one. We need to get out of here. We accidentally dug through to some bugs. More fire rate. Good. Actually, 22.5% fire rate as well. More nitra and the last flower. Good. That roly boy again was having the time of his life there. I'm sure there might be another patch of gold somewhere. I think we might, we might be done with gold. Okay, so now we really need to get some levels. <laughs> it's going to be easier said than done. There's a lot of bongo rocks. We can maybe use those to our advantage. Yeah, I get those plus two levels. Right, turrets mine walls, good. The turrets do what we need. Now we just need to survive. Get as many levels as we can on this floor. So hopefully a magnet comes to say hello. 
I think most of the experience is in this corner-ish. We're too slow to dodge the roly boys, but we can get on this bongo rock now. The horde again. The explodey boys. Bosses that I think will get stronger soon. Yeah, fire rate. Edging might be dangerous with this much speed. Yeah, more move speed. One boss down. Oh, we need to get up for that experience. Move speed. So much from all these bongo rocks. We've got quite a lot down. We're still so slow. What are we down? What are we up to? Move speed. Minus 5%. Yep, plus two weapons. If we can get those bullets bouncing too, that'll be even better, but not required. Okay. Yeah, we'll take the BRT-7. Some more kinetic damage. Plus three weapon levels is fine. We're going to need a lot of weapon levels. It's not as good as fire, right? But... <laughs> Yeah, we'll take some more kinetic damage. Keep us nice and safe. Yeah, we'll take those plus two weapon levels again. Alright, what are we going to get? What are we going to get? Are we going to get plasma bullets too? Are we going to get the ultimate mining turrets? Let's find out. No, but we've got them following us around, and that will do, because we can dig tunnels and they'll just come along with us for the ride. Now we'll take the piercing on the BRT. Three levels on the BRT. We don't want to reduce its fire rate. We'll take the clip size. The last thing we want to do is reduce its fire rate. It's not quite as many levels as I'd like. I would have liked to have been 25 off the first floor, but we're not, we're not bad. We're not bad. Level 23. We haven't had much XP gain yet, I was about to say, but we just got... I think that might have been our first piece. We need to save our gold, unfortunately, because we still need to get our last weapon. If it was for any other weapon, I'd buy it. I, want go. I can't, I can't, I can't not buy the luck. I can't not buy that. Uh, we'll get this fire rate reload speed. Fine. Good. Let's go. Hopefully we're strong enough. A bit of a weird build. Turrets will be mining for us, though. So we'll grab a scanner of some description I would have thought on this floor. They're not mining very fast yet, but that's because they're only level 12. Need a lot more fire rate. Here's all the Morkite. Turrets might help us with it. We asked them nicely. Yeah, there we go. Look. Oh, no, no. They got distracted. First swarm should be fine though. A little bit of dodging. Dodge, dick, huh? dip, dodge, dodge, and what? Dodge, dip, duck, dive, and dodge. Not dodge, dick. Dodge, dick on this channel. Not with all the edging we do, eh? Speaking of, we might need to uh, get into a bit of edging this uh, this floor. Feeling a bit, a bit scared. We've got. We've got quite a few rerolls. Let's get some damage. Spots of gold around. That's nice, nice. We need some pickup radius. That pickup radius is abysmal. Scanner time. Bouncy bullets would be so much better for mine. With the. They're doing it. They're getting the bongo rocks and stuff. Right, XP scanner. That is actually what we want first. How many unique tags are we going to have? Light, spray, kinetic projectile. Con construct turret. Lasting. Seven. Heavy, eight. And then we'll have throwing... Yeah, we should get like 15 or 20% from one of those. We'll help the lead bursters. Now we want the turrets to do more mining because now they have purpose. 
the experience of the turrets. Nice big juicy 18% XP gain. Lead bursters. There they are. Didn't even have to use that many rerolls. Nice. Right, now we need to get those leveled up because they are big on the fire rate. They're big on the projectiles per minute per second. Which is what we're all about. Some more gold there, though. We're all about that as well. Radius, we need some. It's a magnet. This is just what we wanted. Come back down for that magnet later. Right now, we'll go and make sure we haven't missed any hooly bugs. Get these loot bugs as well. They're full of goodies. Oh, that's a boss and another one. Oh, he's spitting on me lots. Oh, God, and there's rolly boys everywhere. Oh, my God, this might be the end of us. Please don't be the end. <laughs> Please don't be the end game. Please. I've worked too hard. I've gone through so many rerolls to get mining turrets. I'm just going to run. Let's go get the magnet for some hopefully big healing. We'll drop this next bongo rock on them though, as they approach. I got rid of the rolly boy. That's good. I think we're going to make it through this floor. Yeah, we need reload speed. We need this reload speed. Something about fire rate? Yep, fire rate. Absolutely. It would have been nice to have them. We've got to take the 12% XP gain. I know that was luck. More fire rate. More piercing? Yeah, we need those leveled up. We need some tank. Lifetime. That's an important upgrade. Reload speed. More fire rate. We've got quite a few more we can probably kill here before we have to go. More luck. There was a legendary there, but it was reload speed for the BRT. If it was reload speed for the uh, lead burst, so that would have been a very hard choice. Alright, so next floor, hopefully we should start seeing the XP come rolling in from our mining turrets, especially if we can get a few upgrades for them here. So I'm coming into the 12 minute-ish point apparently i'm not allowed to use the term midpoint anymore i've been told off using the term midpoint because this isn't the midpoint and of course being technically correct is the best kind of correct so hello everyone please don't forget to uh like the video it really does help it means a lot and the support i've got from you guys has been amazing so i hope you're enjoying the video and if you are yeah hit those buttons that do the things it really means a lot right so what do we need to focus on fire rate i think generally just upgrades for the lead burster Move speed, we need that. Pick up radius. Cluster grenades, absolutely. Very important. Fire rate, reload speed. One more reroll. Anything we need to pin? No. Okay, continue then. Oh, we got more kite again, and we came down upon it. Started with 17 more kite there. I wonder if the bug's still in the game where if you land on 20 more kite, it just fails the mission. You just don't get to the mission pop up. Yeah, plus two weapon levels. We need to get more projectiles out faster. What's our fire rate like on these things? Ah, oh, huge. Huge fire rate. Once we get them to 18, it's going to be even huger. The hugest, some could say. I think turrets to 18 is the is the priority for mining. It's free real estate. They're doing a, they're doing a fair job. There's a lot more mining being done than if I was just doing it by hand. Nitra, gold, all the resources around. I'm kind of glad we got the extra fire rate. I think that might be probably saving our bacon. I'd rather have reload speed on those now. So many of them, they fire so many projectiles. Look how fast our projectile thing's going up. No, we haven't even got one overclock yet. That might have been pure greed from me there. Oh, holy bug, though. Just go stand inside him. It will take the plus three weapon levels. He's not going anywhere. Stand inside him in a minute. Let's get another scanner. Oh, that's right, I got the DRG coupons.
Oh, the only get that we get those, the better. It's not like we're not going to get resources. That means we'll be able to buy more upgrades. That means we don't need to focus on mining so much until we get a bit more movement speed. Also, this guy could always have a scanner for us, you know. Have all sorts of goodies. Get damage on turrets. Where's he gone now? Well, fella's going for the longest runs. Right. Pick up radius. Let's take the extra nitro. Go well with the DRG coupons. I think there's still two more patches to even pick up. Oh, whoops. I thought I was, just about to go. I thought I was going to be able to dodge that. Yep, fire rate. That's what this run's all about. We need, we need a magnet. Oh, big patch of gold. And there's our last nitro patch as well. We should hopefully have a good shop. Get some 18s. Hopefully get the turrets to 18s in this shop. Hopefully get the turrets to 18 before the shop. Please don't be an elite rep. No elite rolly boys. Good. Now we just need to run around until a magnet spawns. It'd be fine, right? Yeah, we do need some more damage. Let's run around trying to get as much experience as we can. Got a bit of pickup radius now, so it's not so bad. Still pretty bad. Fire rate. Oh, it's like they're doing a fair job of mining. There's not too many rocks left, so even without plasma, they, they get the job done. It's just not as fast. More fire rate on them will make the job go a bit quicker. percent fire rate and then 200 percent fire rate right there we go now we're firing in bullets i think we've got all the resources there might be some gold still we should probably go and check make sure we we have got everything yeah, looks like we have still no magnet though oh no there is some more gold I have just enough time to mine that up. Maybe. Last minute magnet, anyone? Oh, 10 luck, though. Like that. Come on, magnet. Come on. No magnets, are there? No magnet enjoyers here. Sad times with no magnets. So right, at least we can have a good shop. Oh, some XP gain. Uh, so we go... Plus two weapon levels here. We don't want to lower their lifetime. We'll take the um, we'll take the fire bullets to make them look cool. We'll take that piercing, because it will help them mine. We'll take that fire rate, same reason. That fire rate, same reason. We'll Reroll again. Pick up radius, we need that. More fire rate, we need that. Lifetime pick up radius. I mean, I want to see XP gain really, but it is what it is. More fire rate. More fire rates. All right, let's go. Let's see what these mining turrets can do now that there's lots of them. Right, we do need to really focus on. We're on floor four. We do need to focus on getting our um, scanners now. We've got one more, one more artifact I want that isn't a scanner. Come on, mine faster. Move speed. Not those choices. I think that gives them yeah, that give yeah, that gives us another unique tag for the reload speed as well when it comes to it. Look at that fire damage. <laughs> That's a lot of projectiles. We're not even we're not, hardly even started yet.
lead bursters will probably keep us mostly safe now. Oh, more move speed. That'll get us around the maps even faster. What are we up to now? 28%. Still a slow dwarf, really. Could do with the turrets being a little bit more efficient at mining. That will come with reload speed, maybe. Small fire rate. No, we'll, when we run back around the map, we'll see. Because the turrets will have been left for a, a time shooting. They do last for 15 seconds. Screen's lagging a bit. Let's try not to anger all the rolly boys at once. Wait for it. Let's get ourselves out of this corner. <laughs> a bit of a spicy one. Had to do some good edging there. Bugs were very pleased with my services. Come on, mine better, turrets. What am I even paying them for, you know? More fire rate. Oh, there's a magnet. Oh, we got the magnet by accident. Uh, yeah, more piercing. I think that will help the mine. XP gain, absolutely. Thought I was going to say no damage doing that run. I couldn't quite see an explodey boy. Oh, 20% more lifetime. Yeah, gold scanner. We need our scanners. Now we need to try and long out this floor so we can get some extra gold. Hopefully our turrets will do an okay job of that now. Maybe. Nitro down there as well. Come on, turrets, do better. Oh, they've mined out this... Oh, no. Yeah, they've mined out some of the gold. Oh, they're doing it. They're getting the job done. We'll go for some more pickup radius. There's rocks breaking. Extra golds are flowing. Plasma turret is definitely the better miners, though. More XP gain. Hopefully we see more bits of gold get picked up as we run around so that we know that the turrets are actually doing an okay job. Oh yeah, yeah. There it comes. Fourth. Yeah, we'll go for some more fire rate on the front firing weapon. Mini gun, which I hate. I wish I had some sort of cryo weapon. <laughs> Must say, this is a bit scary without Eddie. He's about to drop though. Is he about to drop? He feels like he should be about to drop. If like anything would touch him. There you go. Yeah, let's go for plus two weapon levels on those. And then run back to the drop pod. I've got level 60. It's okay. We got quite a bit of extra gold. What's our fire rate up to? 97, 39... 58, 84. I think we can get a lot higher than that, though. This number's going up quite fast, but it could be much, much faster. Absolutely buying that reload speed. Absolutely buying that fire rate. I don't want to reduce the fire... I don't think I want to reduce the fire rate of everything else. Do I? It's 
So it will give us 200 there. We'll produce about... I think that will be a net increase in projectiles. We'll take that as the favourite. We'll get some more fire rate. Some more luck, some more fire rate. We don't need that damage, more fire rate. Some more mining speed, because we're actually having to hit the rocks a lot ourselves. How fast are we now? 28%. By one more move speed, that should be fast enough. A bit more mining speed, and we are good to go. Hopefully the turrets do a better job of mining this time. It's a dreadnought floor, so we should be able to mine everything. We stand still. Go on, turrets. Show me what you can do. I think because they're kinetic bullets, they don't bounce off the walls. They just hit a wall and then they're absorbed, which is uh, why they go a bit slower. But they get the job done. Over time. Just not as good as bouncy ones. So. And mining's not so bad. Gives us something to do while the uh, lead bursters tear everything to pieces. Although they could be mining a bit. Just come on. They're sort of laser, they're laser focused on the bosses. That's fine, I suppose. They're hitting the bongo rocks. We can see that. Hello, Shoe Babe. If you come to assist, let's get more fire rate on those. Although maybe I should have taken the lifetime. What, they, what, they've, got two, they've got 300 fire rate now. And there's lots of them. They're still 65. They're still 45. They're still 91. So I think we're, we're probably okay. A bit more purple-headed mushrooms. Come on. Come on, turrets. Do more mining. That's it. See the walls breaking down slowly. You'd think 45 shots a minute would just hit more walls with low accuracy, wouldn't you? Come on, mine terrace. If I put, you, if I stand here, are they going to mine properly? No, oh, just about. The point is, they're firing a lot of shots per second, which is their primary purpose. Then mining is secondary. We've got to take that luck. Takes us to 69 luck, right? So we couldn't not. Look, there it is, guys. The big, big 69. Nice. Oop, I guess we're going to just bug out of here. There's too many bugs. We'll go back when the time is right. Yep, we're taking the gold scanner. That's the best for more XP gain. More XP gain is more fire rate. Okay, we're taking the 12% move speed. We're now fast enough to get around the maps easily. Holy cow, I'm totally going so fast. Oh! I'm sorry, it's mine better. That's a lot of projectiles. <laughs> We just run around and just let the turrets just slowly chip away at everything. It's not so bad. You know they're doing the work and it's not the Rolly Boys because occasionally we pick up a piece of gold. It's the twins. XP gang. We've got a lot of levels to get. If we're going to get enough fire rate. Boys being annoying. Minigun not quite doing the job of keeping me safe that I'd hope it would. <laughs> that stuff's dropping. Fast enough, I suppose. We shouldn't focus on mining rocks. Probably not worthwhile. Bunch of experience in the middle somewhere. Oh, it's up here. 
heard the chime of the elites dying. Or fire rate of all projectile weapons. What does that take this up to now? 321. I bet we can get it to 666. Maybe we can get over 10,000 shots per second when we do all the math, right? With everything going, you know, all the turrets up, all of the... We're still picking up the odd bit of gold as we run around, you know? Definitely do with some more XP rate. Some more luck. Yes, this for sciencing is purely to see how high we can get our fire rate. That's why artifacts are turned off. I'm not too fast about what scanners I get, and there's only really two artifacts that really count, but I just wanted to make sure we could spend as much as possible in the shop. I want to see how big number get. I don't see this would be possible. This isn't like impossible luck. It's not even getting four or five scanners is quite normal. We'll be running with seven, I think. Especially now they've added rerolls to the game. Just, uh, you know, take some time. Please forgive me. He gets level 68. This Rolly Boy dies. Oh, the Rolly Boy's not going to die. We don't actually deal that much damage. Oh, we got to level 68. Oh, nice. Yeah, let's get more reload speed on the turrets. We can get more of those out at once. We'll grab that reload time artifact soon. Then that will increase our, our fire rate a lot as well. Uh, fire rate. Fire rate. We'll grab that mining speed. XP gain, fire rate, fire rate, fire rate. Let me try again. Luck. Fire rate. Show me more. Grab a bit more mining speed, which takes up to 108%. So we can make up for the fact that the turrets aren't so good with our own with our own dwarven hands now. Yeah, we just walk through. If we just walk through the rocks, it's fine. More kites a bit of a bit more of a struggle, but for the most part, we can just mine. If the turrets follow us in, they should shoot walls because they won't have targets necessarily. There we go, look at all that gold flowing in like a river. Some nitrous, a nitrous scanner wouldn't go amiss, I don't think. Not that we need it for the pickled nitro, it's just to buy more fire rate upgrades for the weapons. Loot bugs disappear in a blink of an eye now. There are a lot of numbers on screen. We're going to have to stand in the middle of a pack soon. Just to see what it looks like. I suppose we'll get the upgrades on the minigun. It might have some sort of up, big upgrade that gives it fire rate, I don't remember. Or we can make it also have fire bullets, just for coolness. Alright, I guess we're going for the last gold scanner then. Do we take that reload speed now? It's going to give us a lot more grenades. So it goes from 2.62 to 2.1. So that's like a 20% increase in grenades. Probably an increase in turrets as well. Yeah, worth it. Need more reload speed on those grenades though, for sure. Oh, there's all the nitro on this floor. I think getting those upgrades now is going to increase our projectiles more than getting another scanner now. Because that's that's just more flaws of them doing 50 you know, 20% more grenades, which is 20% more bullets. 
Oh, Reload speed or fire rate. So I haven't got much reload time on it as base yet. So let's take the reload time. That'll get, again, a lot more turrets out, which is a lot more shots per second. We still need to be mining for more resources. There's some nitro. Turrets getting the gold in. Just bits and pieces appearing. Gold over there. Oh god, we've taken we've got 69 hit points left. That's not good. We're getting some losing some frames from all of the projectiles. That's how you know you've got a good build when you're dropping frames. You can't see the bugs, they can't see you, right? We do kind of need to keep ourselves safe. Got to take that lifetime. More lifetime is more grenades up at once, which is more bullets per second. You can see the projectile number is moving pretty fast. I don't know how I managed to dodge all that. I think I do need some more damage, though. I feel like our damage is starting to, uh, starting to lack a bit. Hopefully we can buy a bunch in the shop. I think I'm going to stay kind of in a spot and stop running around like a madman to try and get some damage done on these elites. If they land on the lead bursters for a while, that should deal a lot of damage to them. Which it did. I will take some max HP. I'm kind of getting concerned. Mine through here for an escape. That one boss left. Just needs to uh, take some damage. Stand on a lead burster, you know, something like that. I think he's about to drop. Lead burster's going to get him in a second. There we go. All right, now we just need to get safely out of here. Which we should be able to do, because the drop pod's right there. It is. Extra 100% armor might be good. Oh my god, we made it with two health! I'm buying a heal. I, never, I haven't bought a heal for a long time. I'm buying one. They're all really good upgrades. More fire rate. Some luck. Kinetic damage sounds fine. Some more luck. Um, oh, do you know what? Find the HP as well. <laughs> Tanky dwarf. <laughs> oh, they're up to 500 rounds per second, and there's three of them, so that's 1500 rounds per second. I think I still got to about 2000 rounds per second on another run. I think we're going to get to a lot more than that. Of course, that run had no artifact tampering, and this run does have artifact tampering. Still, a good for science experiment, nonetheless, which is what it's for. A eh? bit of fun. If I had the weekend free, I would have done it properly. Thomas. Why are. Uh... Oh, that's right, because the turrets just stay spawned in. So this has all just been cleared out by turrets shooting. I feel like we're doing a lot more we're doing a lot more now. In terms of overall damage, but I feel like that was quite a good shot. Particularly when it came to our health. One thing about taking the all scanner run is 
Definitely miss out on damage. Job doesn't make up for the damage. The cards don't, extra cards don't make up for the damage that you miss from artifacts. It takes a long time until they do. Right, we're taking the fire rate for all the overall more bullets. We're now up to 510. And you can see the class mechanic is going off multiple times per second now. All right. We're in a bit of a crap place. We're dealing with a swarm. Swarm is going to be all over the landing zone. Imagine. Oh my god, they're, they're not dying. Things are not dying. Swarm is not dying. We're not doing anywhere near enough damage. Oh, yeah. We're going to need more HP. We're going to have to rely on our massive health regen, I think. Bongo rocks and other such pricks. Okay. I hope this next shop's good to us. That's one down. Yep, took the nitro scanner. Some piercing. Help us do a lot more damage, I hope. Right, what scans we got? So we've got one boss down. What are the others? Oh, that's because we dropped the drop pod on his head. We've got two bosses down. Keep it close enough to get absolutely annihilated by the hundreds of turrets, and we should be okay. Where's the other one? Where is the other boss? Oh, there it is. So we'd like to get this wrapped up, Mission Control. You're quite right. This is getting rather taxing on the old uh, frame rate. Also, send me over this way. <laughs> I'm taking the 50% damage. My lord, do we need some damage. Oof. I hope you're enjoying this one, guys. It's uh, a bit sweaty. Uh, right, so XP gains some more fire rate. More fire rate. Don't need that potency. Fire rate. Pick up radius. Damage. Lifetime. These now last for 4.6 seconds. The fire rate of 573. And these last for 23 seconds. The fire rate of 75. So once everything's going, I reload time of 2.1 seconds. So we've got six grenades out. So there's 3, 000, about 3,300 bullets per second just from these. So there should be anyway. About 107 from these. That will be about legit. This will be 10, 11, 12. So there's 11 of those at 75. So that will be another 800. So I would imagine we're somewhere close to about 4,000 rounds per second at the moment. Let's make that a little bit more. One more reroll. Take some more luck. Yeah, we take some more luck. We're up to 89. And now, yeah, we're up to 596 fire rate. I think we can get more. I don't think this is anywhere near our final form. Especially now we've got Nitra. A Nitra scanner. Gonna be picking up everything. Hey, look at that. Yeah, now, now we're clearing. Turrets are getting it cleared now. All resources flowing in. 
Even the meta ones that I don't care about. I feel like we hit, may have hit some sort of maximum bullet cap. Because we don't seem to be doing that much more damage. We'll soon be able to work that out at the end. These things have some implicit bullet cap. Some more stuff up here. There's loads more nitro on this floor somewhere as well. I don't think we've found any patches yet. Maybe one. There's some. Friend gold. That guy hit for 107, and that was through our 56 armor. That's quite brutal. Let's get some more armor. I'm dropping too many frames to reliably dodge the roly boys. I have to be able to tank them. At least a couple of hits. Let's go get another scanner. Maybe a nitro scanner again. I don't think an XP scanner at this point would be worth a lot. God. Same deal as last time. It's just too hairy. Too many enemies. Frame rate is going too bad. Too many bullets. No directional weapons. This is... Oh, this, this feels like it might be impossible. We just don't have the damage. The explodey boys going off certainly help. I don't feel like the enemy spawns can figure out what they actually need to do. With, yeah, we need more damage. All the elites in here. That's one of them. Now, hopefully, we can get back for that supply at some point. I don't know if we can because when we leave the monsters, they just stop um, really reacting, they're just sort of walking on the spot again. More projectile damage. If I try and grab that now, that's end of us. We might have to sacrifice that. Drop pod. Oh no, maybe, 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 maybe. But yes. Come on, put it somewhere safe. Safe enough. Safe enough. Oh my god, this is so rough without any damage. <laughs> oh my god. Reload speed. Uh, piercing. Damage. Damage. We need damage. Damage. Lifetime. Let that have some more fire rate. More luck. More HP. Damage. Let's pick up radius we up to. Let's get a bit more. Try again. Move speeds. We've got a lot of move speed. We'll be okay. Piercing or damage? Piercing's going to help them hit so many more targets. Damage on these would just be useful. No, we'll go for piercing. One more reroll. We get 30% fire rate. So there's 630 now. 129, 81. <laughs> Come on. We can make it through this. We can do this. This isn't hyper stressful at all. This isn't an absolutely rubbish build at all. It's fine. Firing as many projectiles as you can is fine. There's two more floors to go. Come on. Show me that you can kill the small crabs. 
that I can stand here and that they just melt. Thank you. Right, let's go get some Bulo caps then. It feels like now we actually might have just hit enough damage. That looks like it's just melting a bit now. I mean, that's the first Bulo cat we've seen. Oh, there's quite a few of them. Now. There's more Bulo caps there. Uh, do we take more armor? Yeah, I think we take more armor. That uh, crit chance might have been good. It's the last Hooli. Kinetic damage. Rogue might change your life, mate. Might save your life. It's not going to be anything good apart from another scanner. Yeah, we'll just take the other Nitro scanner. We've got all three Nitro scanners. Yeah. Hopefully we get enough nitro to buy enough damage cards to kill the last red door. Damage or fire rate cards. Maybe maybe damage. We need to prioritize winning. So now at this point I feel like something's happening and the enemies aren't taking as much damage, and I don't know why. Yeah, we'll take some more fire rate on those. They're almost up to 100. So what mushrooms to get? There's two, three in fact. One more mushroom. One of the bosses is already on really low health. Must have trodden on a grenade. Grab our last mushroom. Well done. You've got them all. And we'll try and just. Flying one is not taking as much damage as the other ones. Flying one is being a bit annoying, actually. The other two are going down just fine. Oh, no, the flying one's going down fine as well. We're okay. A bunch of levels out. I think that's only our second magnet. 20% uh, more damage, yes. We got to 100 luck. Oh, no, 94. I was like, I haven't seen a green card for a while, but we can still get them. Alright. We're safely out. What's our fire rate up to now? 6.30. But there's many grenades out at once. Almost sometimes nine grenades out at once. Oh, thanks for the XP gain now. Okay. We'll take that fire rate. We don't need the XP gain now. Fire rate. I don't think I've taken any crit chance or crit damage through this whole run. <laughs> Lifetime. Reload speed. Fire rate. Reload speed. Let's get this nice and low. More damage. Yeah, why not? Lifetime. More reload speed there. I suppose we can start taking a bit of crit chance. Of course. Right, one more reroll then. Last reroll, we might as well. It's not <laughs> just so we can see that we've got no resources left. That was such a good reroll. So, six. Five, nine. We need to get one more upgrade. We, as I said, we were going to get six, six, six. Fire rate on those. That actually would be bullet hell. I mis uh, mistitled my uh, mis thumbnail of my last video. This is the real bullet hell. This is actually an awful lot of bullets. <laughs> A 
Oh look, 50% more fire rate. What's it up to now? 141, they dropped to 99.57. It's a shame we're not going to get to spend any of the resources that we get on this floor, because we're going to have an awful lot of nitra. <laughs> Get the nitrogenic powder in it. I feel like everything's getting killed quick enough now. Finally. I finally feel safe. <laughs> that army of turrets. Look at that spray of bullets! Oh my god! I think that's got to be the thumbnail, right? Look at that! That's awesome! Oh! Uh, let's get some more reload speed. Down to a second. We've got we've got 26 turrets out. Doing another 2,600 shots per second. And then we've got these out doing what? There's three of those out now at a time. So that's nine. So 660 times nine. You're like, what? 4,000. 4,500. No, wait. 5,400. You're about six. We've got about 10,000 shots a second. We should have anyway. So if we can long out this floor, we might be firing millions of shots. We might be. If my maths is correct. I mean, the whole. Everything is bullets, right? I can't see anything apart from bullets now. I've got another XP scanner, yeah. See if we can uh, see if we get an X a level from this mining this rock. We did not. What about this rock? There's, oh, there's more rock here. There's some gold in. Go, little mining turrets, go! Look at them, they're so fast now that, you, that they fire 100 shots a second. Maybe this is the maybe this is the thumbnail. I just get the other side. Who knows what the thumbnail could be? Let's go for some more crit shots. There's more gold. That's a lot of numbers. An awful lot of numbers. There is fire damage going out at a similar rate. the twins that we need to start running. I don't know if they'll last very long. Oh, no, no, look at that. They're lasting an no amount of time. Range one's getting absolutely dicked on. Oh, let's go see what's down. Oh, loot box. Yummy, yummy. Oh, there's nitro as well. Let's go grab that. And then we'll just go for another bit, bit more of a run. So still look at how fast that's that's an example of how fast our um I, I couldn't tell you how many times that's going off a second it's multiple times a second you can see just the constant spray of bullets let's go for some more lifetimes so we've got even more grenades out for even longer Well, there were a couple of floors that were really, really hairy on this one. See, just just turning all the artifacts on doesn't necessarily make it easier. <laughs> it is it is a for science. But yeah, fire rate, pretty funny. Computer can't really handle it though. I think I might need a new one. <laughs> Look at them! <laughs> so many bullets. Keep shooting. Don't stop. If I'm if I'm right, this is another maybe three hundred thousand bullets that's being fired right now. Although I think there's a cap on the, I feel like the lead bursters can only fire so fast. That is ridiculous. I'm kind of glad they're projectile and not plasma because that wall of lead is pretty ridiculous. So there we go, guys. 
Let's send the projectiles. Put them in now. I'll give you five, four, three, two, one. Polly down there. Press the like button as well. Um, here we go. Only 933,000? What? That's not right. That can't be counted right. We had 659 fire rate on this. But there's three grenades. 141 on that. 99 on that. And there's 27 turrets out at once. Something's not quite calculating there. And you saw how often our, our thing was going off. It was going off 10 times a second, which is a 1,000 uh, projectiles a second. We were playing for, what, 45 minutes? So, blah, 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 blah. quick maths, 2,400, 2,700 seconds. 1,000 times a second, 1,000 shots a second. I would estimate as a flat, even if the numbers on there are to believe, would, would bring you up to 2.7 million I don't think that number's correct. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. It's awesome. I know I just said that, but, you know, maybe hit the subscribe button instead. And I hope to see you again in another video or on a live stream soon. Have a good one.